folks, I'm out here at the Desert Megaphone. The Desert Megaphone is up there on the rocks behind me. Uh, back behind me this way. Yeah. Is uh, far out to the right is Devil's Playground. Somewhere in between here is Razor Road. Uh, I don't know whether you can see that long stripe of white there, but that is the railroad, uh, rail cars. They seem to be parked out there. Yeah, the railroad comes through here. But anyway, I need to get moving. I was hoping to get out here earlier, you know, but yeah. Hmm. So we're going to hoof it up real quick up here. We're going to bypass the megaphone, which is up there on that peak right there. We're going to go over here and uh, do some hiking back up in here. And see if I can find that uh, arrow, uh, that little arrow pointer. Yeah. So this time I'm prepared. I got some uh, water with me. Last time I didn't have no water. I was just on a little leisurely hike. I wanted to go up to the megaphone there. But anyway, let's get out of here before it's getting late. Daylight's burning. I have no idea what I'm going to do after this or where I'm going. So let's go hiking. I definitely don't want to be hiking back here in the dark. So, let's get a move on here.
but uh, a nice view up here right now. The weather's still good. Looks like I only got maybe an hour of sun, maybe less. I don't know where I'm gonna camp or nothing. But I'm gonna have to get down this hill and uh, continue on. Came from out that way. Um, out that way. There's some kind of compound there. You know, homesteaders or what but they actually got a runway out there there's an airplane parked out there so don't know what that's about but you go around this way yeah yeah looking east I, I think Got the megaphone, desert megaphone is right here, right about there somewhere. I'm just below it, can't see me from here. But I think I'm gonna head out that way. That's uh, Cru Crucero. Yeah, you got those little sand hills that see out there on the right. And that was the town of Crucero, which the railroad stopped as it made its way through here. I hear a lot of motorcycles and stuff, but it is a holiday here in the United States. It's Thanksgiving Day weekend. It's a four-day weekend. So I do hear a lot of motorcycles and ATVs out there riding around. The official riding area is that way on the other side of the uh, railroads. Railroad tracks, yeah. It's Razor Road, OHV which is off highway, California off highway vehicle area. Unlimited use, I think that's what is designated. Out this way somewhere, I don't think you can see it in this camera, but with my binoculars, you can see Razor Ranch. Look up Razor Ranch on, a, you can look up Razor Ranch on a, on the internet, do internet search Razor Ranch, I think it's R-A-S-O-R. -S or was it Orange County Keith or something like that but I believe that's their property over there although last time I checked their website it hasn't been uh, updated since like 2009 so maybe he's dead who knows anyways got to head down I'm uh, racing against the sunshine now yeah all right, I think you can see the old path of the railroad train, uh, with the railroad, railroad train. Right now, as the sun's going down, you can see it curve, or curve and go that way. That's the path of the old railroad. And it actually goes out that way. It's where I'm headed, yeah. Once I get down from here. Well guys, getting kind of late, uh, I'm going to at least head back to the railroad tracks and uh, we'll see how long that takes. It's not that far, but it is getting late and traveling at night can get you lost even with the GPS. I'm monitoring the uh, radio, CB radio channels right now, see if I pick up any more four-wheelers out here doing the Mojave Trail, which is way out there. But uh, I'm gonna stick to the main road here before it gets dark, take me back to the railroad tracks and I can almost follow the railroad tracks up and down back to uh, Afton Canyon or out the other way to uh, Cal Baker Road. Yeah. Yes. So let's hit it, Jack. 